For the city of Chicago, it was the moment they hoped would be a game changer. So I've come here today to urge you to choose Chicago for the same reason I chose Chicago nearly 25 years ago. The reason I fell in love with the city I still call home. President Obama in full campaign mode, this time trying to win votes from the International Olympic Committee delegates. I will listen to him very carefully, and uh, this is one of the, maybe the most charismatic men on the planet. He was joined by First Lady Michelle Obama, Chicago's mayor, and various U.S. Olympic Committee members. It's about inspiring this generation and building a lasting legacy for the next. After a week that saw star-studded support in Copenhagen from Oprah and some of the world's most famous Olympians. But the other finalist cities aren't without their own star power. Soccer great Pele on hand to push Rio. King Juan Carlos of Spain hoping to see Madrid walk away with its crowning moment. And Japan's prime minister looking for a Tokyo triumph. Tough competition as the other finalists offer their presentations. And the president is already on his way back home. I think Chicago could not have made a better presentation. A whirlwind trip many hope will give the Windy City its Olympic win. And while not everyone in Chicago is convinced the games are a good idea, residents here are making plans to gather to watch the announcement this morning, a decision that could soon change this city's course. Kristen Dahlgren, NBC News, Chicago.